get over here. Oh, we're not. Never mind. I whiffed it hard. I blame Genji. I just fuck it. Sucks for that guy. He just. He backed up into it. I mean, I can't blame him because he backed up into it, but I mean, you still know it's there. Poor guy. Poor girl. Uh. <laughs> what? That, she's not dead. Fuck that. Uh. Playing Overwatch today, guys, because it's free for the weekend. It's also on sale for $35 instead of 60 I believe, in the Black Friday sale. And, um... God damn, I'm whiffing it hard. I'm normally good with Roadhog's hook, but fuck. Um... What was I gonna say? Ah, the Black Friday sale. I, uh... I consulted with the better half yesterday on, uh, or was it Friday? No, it was Friday. I consulted with her on which game I should get. Um, I didn't upload on Friday because, I, again, as I said yesterday, I spent the whole day Friday with the better half. It was where, one of those rare occasions where I actually got to, so Bay comes first, first and always. Um, but I counter it, you know, I always either upload twice on Saturday or one on Saturday and one on Sunday, which is typically my day off anyway, but, uh, I was talking to her Friday, and, um, well, obviously because I spent the whole day with her, but, you know, I asked her, because she knows I like Overwatch, you know, I get frustrated with it just like everybody else, you know, because of teammates or... Well, mostly because of teammates, but I love the game. I absolutely love the game for what it is, even as simplistic as it is. It's just, it's just a fucking MOBA, but I love the game, and um, I asked her, you know, what should I get? Because, as everyone knows, my money is limited, and there was a lot of good games on sale for a lot. I mean... I'll be covering this tomorrow, like, which games are actually worth buying tomorrow in the, uh, video I'm planning to do, but there's a lot of good games for really cheap compared to what they normally are, and it's just not, like, one game. It's, like, a package deal with everything, or you get another game on top of it. It's really worth it. Oof, whipped in the back of the head. But I asked her straight up. I was like, because I value her opinion above everyone else's because I mean she's never steered me wrong it's because of her why I started doing YouTube but uh, I asked her straight up like should I get overwatch or should I get Assassin's Creed Syndicate you know because I wanted both but I can only get one if I'm going to be able to get Final Fantasy 15 when it comes out next Tuesday I had to look at my calendar um and she was adamantly steering me towards Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Like, adamant. Anything besides Overwatch. Because I mentioned Far Cry Primal, which was another game I'd like to get. Because uh, I love Far Cry. And I didn't get to play 4. Again, limited cash. But Primal was like what you would expect from Far Cry, you know? It's just... Just cavemen. And, uh... She was... She was, she basically steered me towards Assassin's Creed Syndicate, which I will do videos on. I might have to start a new game because I've already passed the tutorial. I've already assassinated a minor Templar leader and part of Whitechapel. So I might have to start a new game if I'm going to do like a full let's play on it. But, uh, she was just adamantly steering me towards anything besides Overwatch, which I thought was strange. But, uh, <laughs> but now it makes sense, and, um, Play the game. oh, wow, I did, what did I get? Oh, yeah, that, that's totally POG worthy, fucking nabbing Genji right out of the sky. <laughs> Fuck 
Fuck you, said that. Fuck you. Yeah, fucker. What was I saying? There's been like fucking lobbies between here and there. Oh, um. Yeah, she was adamantly steering me towards anything besides Overwatch, which I thought was strange, but I just went with it because, you know, I value her opinion over everyone else's. Oh dear! Um, but yeah, I bought. I keep saying um a lot, but it's because I keep losing train of thought. But I bought Assassin's Creed Syndicate, and I'm happy with my choice. But when I got my mail yesterday, there was a package in there from the better half, and it had a card in there that I probably won't read because she'll probably die if I do. But it was a really nice card, and she wrote her own little thing in there besides the thing that was already in there, as cards typically have. And it made my day. It made my week. I just, I was all smiles. I, w I was <sighs> super happy. Super, super happy. The card was amazing. Um. <laughs> And I uh, looked in there because, I mean, it was too big for just a card. And I noticed something green in there. And, <laughs> yes, I, I, mean, I teabagged the Genji because he thought he had my number. That's what I don't like about a lot of Genji players is they think they're so goddamn good with Genji that no one can kill them. You, got, you learned a lesson right there, friend. Um, but inside the package was a copy of Overwatch, and <laughs> that made me even happier because she knows I love Overwatch for what it is. Yes, the teammates can be frustrating as fuck, losing can be frustrating as fuck, but just the game as it is, just the game without the people, I mean, you can play against bots. I love Overwatch. I love it. And she actually took the time to actually get me the game and actually paid money for it, I'm guessing. So that meant a lot to me because you guys don't understand. Like, I've dated girls before. I have. I've dated girls before. They not once have ever got me anything. Ever. I've always been the one getting them stuff and giving them shit. Never have I ever gotten anything from any girl I've ever been with, and she did it on her own free will out of the kindness of her heart, and this is why I love this woman. I love her to bits. She's just perfect, and she I know she hates it when I say she's perfect, because, you know, it's like, I'm not perfect. And technically, nobody's perfect, but I, my response is always the same. You're perfect for me. And it's true. She is absolutely perfect for me. Fucking Zenyana. Bob and weave, bitch! Yeah. Can't hit when I'm bunny hopping all over the place. I will halo jump your ass. I will bunny hop. Call it a bitch move, I don't give a shit. I will bunny hop if it means my life is saved. <laughs> I'm getting distracted. I've known this woman for the better part of a decade, and we've talked off and on through the years, but only just recently, for like the past year, going on year and a half, have we actually full blown. It might actually be closer to two years now, but I'm, I think it's closer to a year and a half. We've been talking seriously, and it's just blossomed into a full-blown relationship, and I'm the happiest I've ever been with this woman. Ever. And I like to think she is too. It shows. <laughs> Fucking Farah. Jesus Christ. Getting fucking player, like, character achievements in this game must be random. Because you cannot be... F <laughs> it, it's so case-specific. 
I'm fucked, but I'm taking this asshole with me. You're goddamn right. Son of a bitch. I knew that there was no way out. That was a suicide mission. But I didn't give a shit. I was killing somebody. <sighs> but, uh... <laughs> Few people ever meet the person that's right for them. You know, they just settle because, you know, they either got pregnant in high school or whatever or they just found somebody early and just didn't want to go anywhere else but few people actually just when they're with their better half, it's really their better half, you know? There's no Damn it. Worth it. <laughs> At least I got the bastion. Um, few people ever meet the person like they can just be around all day and not fight. We've never fought. Ever. And it's just... It's great. I mean, I'm not trying to be like, oh, my relationship's better than yours. It's just... When you meet that one person that everything just clicks into place and makes sense- Fuck you! <laughs> not that- not the fuck you part. That was for... Junkrat. But... When you meet that one person and everything just clicks and nothing... is bad. Everything is great. Oh, come on! This diva fucking has my number, I swear! She wants me dead bad- See this shit?! Damn! Oh, damn, bring around the rosy with this bitch! Fuck off! Oh, god damn it. But, uh. Kitten, I love you. And yes, I call her Kitten. Sue me. That's. Everybody has pet names for their better head. But I call her Kitten, so shut up. <laughs> kitten, I love you. I think I ha always have loved you, even, you know, way back when. Oh, Dark Souls. Dark Souls reference! But, yeah, Kitten, I love you. I think I've always loved you, even way back then. God damn this fucking diva! Shit! I swear she has it out for me! I'm not wasting this- I'm not wasting this ult on one fucking person. Well, I did it with Bastion, but no. I'm not doing it. Look, now she's running! Fucking- I did not mean to melee. God. I love you. I think I've loved you all these years, and it's just recently we've been able to actually make it into something. I'm so happy you're in my life. I love you to bits. I know I say it every day like 14 times, but I because it's only true. It's true. Oh ho ho! Suck my explosions! I say it because it's true. And I know you know it's true, but that won't stop me from saying it. I love you, I love you, I love you, thank you so much for the gift. I know I said that yesterday, but I'm saying it here because I'm trying to embarrass you. <laughs> I love you. And I look forward to our future together, I really do. Kisses and hugs. 